Hello, Jacob here. I have three jerseys to show to you today. All three totally different jerseys of the three uh, <laughs> jersey spectrums. A uh, replica, a semi-pro, and a fully authentic. And three totally different sports. Football, in this case college football, hockey, and baseball. So, uh, without further ado, let's get into the pickups here. Now, as I said before, I picked up a college football jersey. Actually, I picked up two college football jerseys, but uh, one of them hasn't even shipped yet, so, or at least according to eBay, it hasn't shipped. So I may have to contact the seller here and see what's up with that, but that's another topic for another way. Anyway, <laughs> this particular jersey is of a university that is pretty well known. Um, Nike sponsors them. Well, their headquarters are in the exact same area as the university. And they come out with about, oh, I don't know, 80 or 90 different jerseys every year. And pretty much almost every single one of them that I've seen, I've wanted. But, uh, finally found this one on eBay for a good price. And dead stock, too, which you rarely ever see. But anyway. It is an Oregon Ducks Nike game jersey size extra large. So, uh, first thing is the uh, Mighty Oregon stitched into the uh, top here. The uh, neck tag, which is Nike's newest thing where they don't actually have a neck tag. It's in the jersey, so it makes it more comfortable and doesn't rub against your neck and cause it to get red and itchy. The Oregon O pack with the uh, little, uh, looks like diamond or pentagon, or shield I should say, shield shape with the Nike swoosh and the uh, heat pressed six. And then of course the drop tag. It's, you know, dead stock of course. Six on the side with the feathers on the back, the six heat pressed on and the feathers as well as the other press six. So yeah, that's my first jersey. My second jersey is the semi-pro, and uh, starting to get more and more into hockey jerseys. Well, case in point, I am now up to three before this one. Let's see here. Yeah, three. And uh, this will make my fourth one, and it is of my local hometown, or local hometown, area team this is a Minnesota Wild. This is again a Minnesota Wild semi-pro size extra large. I think this is their alternate home if I remember right. You can see here the Minnesota Reebok and the uh, Reebok sort of neck tag. The tight or the uh, strap or the drawstring to tighten it or loosen it as needed. The uh, wild logo which is it's like embroidered on, it's not stitched. It's just like a patch essentially on here. And the uh, jock tag. This is an extra large because my Thomas Vanek was a double X and I'm not making that mistake ever again. <laughs> well, that thing is a dress on me. On the side here, the wild patch. And of course, as I said before, dead stock. And uh, Reebok on the sleeve. On the back, Reebok again with the other wild patch on the side. And Reebok on the back. All right, and for my last jersey, this is my authentic baseball jersey. I haven't picked up one of these in a while, and this actually makes only my second Twins Majestic jersey, and the first legit Twins jersey, because the other one is a fake, but again, if you've watched my videos in the past, that has a special story. It's like, you know, a family heirloom. <laughs> in kind of a remembrance of somebody who's no longer with us, so... 
But anyway, it's even of that same kind of color. And this is probably my favorite jersey. And it is a Minnesota Twins cream slash home alternate size 52 from Majestic. And as you can see here, this is all uh, stitched on the Velcro, which my fake one doesn't have. The patch on the side here, which is actually <laughs> the correct way, and the Majestic logo. And if you look closely, how you can tell an authentic on here is thanks to a Mighty Mouse or yeah, Mighty Mouse fan, hometown fitted, a lot of the MLB collectors out there. There's a uh, little uh, dot on this one. So yeah, and again, dead stock on the back. MLB logo. And the inside tag. Made in USA. So, uh, yeah, this will conclude this round of Jersey Pickups. Stay tuned as I have some more coming, as well as hats and other miscellaneous apparel. So until we meet again, this is Jacob, and have a good day.